Hey guys, Travis Gillespie here. We've been working with indirect measurements to solve problems, and here's another one for you. Use the similar triangles to find the height of the lamppost. Well, all of this information is jumbled up right here, so what I'm going to do is help myself out. Let's break it up. So I'm gonna draw a big triangle, and next to it I'm gonna draw another triangle. And I'm just going to match the information in the picture with the correct triangles below. So the lamp post is the larger of the two objects. I know it has a height of H. And it has a shadow of 12 feet. Also, the smaller triangle or the smaller post has a height of 5 feet. and it has a shadow length of four feet. Cool, so once I've separated it, the information just kind of stands out a little bit easier, and I can put a little divider in between these two values, and also here, and I have my proportions set up as h is to 12 as five is to four. Let's go ahead and take the cross products. I have 12 times five, four times h. So 4h is equal to 60. How do we isolate the variable h? Well, we have to undo multiplication of 4. We'll do that through dividing by 4. And if I do it to this side, I've got to keep the equation balanced. Let's do it to the other side. The 4 and the 4 are going to cancel. And I am left with h is equal to 15. Well, the post, the lamp post, has to be... 15 feet tall. Great, guys. See you in the next video.